When checking out, I learned that the shebang doesn't accept credit cards and I don't have enough cash. In a last minute dash, I'm running from bank to bank in search of an operational ATM. Multiple banks are closed due to internet failures, which is a common problem in Puerto Princesa. My time is limited as I have a scheduled van to El Nido this morning. really freaked me out because I was declined the first time and I thought I wasn't going to be able to get money out for some reason because Wells Fargo always puts blocks on my card but my limit was half what I thought it was for withdrawal so I was able to get it okay shebang please you can just sit down. thank you sir thank you very much you have, a, have a good day next stop El Nido to tour the beautiful islands. It's kind of a somber moment for me too. I really love the people here at Shebang. I ended up staying here a couple of nights longer than I thought I would um, just because there was more to do around Puerto Princesa than I originally thought. Thank you Quentin for showing me some of those places. The staff here at the Shebang has been absolutely phenomenal. They're just great people super kind super friendly really took me in and made this place feel like a home the food is excellent the accommodations are nice and it's all in, all around just a fantastic place to be i would stay here anytime and if you find yourself flying to palauan uh, you'll be landing in puerto princesa most likely make sure to check out the shebang hostel i almost forgot my motorcycle mounts for the gopro do not forget to take your mounts off when you return your motorcycle. All right, van is here, it's time to go. High five. Thanks, buddy. So after not catching the first van because it was absolutely overloaded with people and they wanted me to sit on like half a seat and everybody on the van was complaining, uh, there's another empty van here. I'm sure they plan to pick more people up, but there's actually room for me to get on this one. There's room for my luggage. Even though I was excited to explore El Nido and the surrounding islands, I was a little sad to be leaving Puerto Princesa. There were still so many things left undone. I enjoyed Puerto a lot more than I expected. Now I find myself looking back at the time I did have and the opportunities I'd miss. So it's basically a fried banana wrapped in um, some sort of like rice tortilla. Delicious. So, still haven't left Palawan yet. Uh, we jumped on a van about an hour ago and they brought us right to their travel agency and said they had to wait for somebody from the airport and then they left and picked somebody up from a hotel and still haven't gotten the people from the airport. Originally an 8.30 a.m. departure, we finally left the city at 12.45. The trip takes about five hours and is a very bumpy ride. I seriously considered taking the bus and in the future would probably do that instead. Do your research and choose the best option for you. Direct flights are available but are limited and fill up quickly. You're la laughing at they're definitely laughing at me. Local hot sauce. Made with love by Mel. Supposed to park it. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. 
I saw you doing some dance moves back there. Oh, what? All the elements pull us apart, but I'm holding on. Know your hands burn hard as I'm reaching out into the dark. And your arms are tied, holding on. About an hour from El Nido, our van driver picked up a family of six and packed them into our van. I had plenty of room and didn't mind, but you could see the frustration on the faces of passengers who paid for their seats. Immediately, El Nido looks and feels a lot different than Puerto Princesa. It's been a long, exhausting day, and I'm so excited to finally be here. I can't wait to get checked in and start exploring. I can already tell I'm going to love this place. All right, we're there at my room, Milan Grace. Well, it's tiny, but uh, I'm okay with that. I don't really plan on spending a whole lot of time in my room. I plan to be outside most of the time. There's the bed. There's the wall. There's the shower. There's the toilet. Uh, the power went out. I turned the generator off or something, and the light went out in my room. So I'm gonna have to. Oh! We have light. Now it's time for me to get some rest and prepare for what promises to be an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow, travelers. Welcome to El Nido.